Let's talk some travel ideas with Austin Travels this morning. We're talking with Kristen Finan about some places she discovered in and around Nashville, Tennessee. How are you doing? I'm good. Thanks for having me. Yeah, thanks for coming on. You went with you and your family uh, just to Nashville and the surrounding areas, right? That's right. Yeah, we did a girls trip, just my two oldest daughters and me. Basically, we found a concert we wanted to see and okay. then planned a trip around. Yeah, yeah it's a good idea. Yeah, it's a good idea. a fun way to handle it. Um, so we started in Franklin, and I had never been to Franklin, but Franklin is just about 30 minutes outside of Nashville. But it has this completely different feel because it's got like a 16 block main street all the boutiques and restaurants and you feel like you're in a small town but you're right next to nashville yeah. so we fell completely in love with this bookstore called landmark Bookstell booksellers and it's the kind of place it's like a shop around the corners so, now you know you go in and it feels so old school and so quaint and it's actually a place that gets your creative juices flowing. So it actually was the subject of a best-selling book and it was a lifetime movie setting. Okay. So it's just a really fun, like different atmosphere in Franklin. Yeah. And while you're there, you also have to just go down the street, like five minutes to this area called Leaper's Fork. And how I would describe that is like green. If you've been like to New Braunfels area where green is, it's like this artist town and great food, but so small. And there's actually um, a turquoise shop there. It's in a tiny cabin that's run by Chris Stapleton's wife, Morgan. So yeah. they tell you that if you're there, you actually might see Chris Stapleton running errands for his wife. That's amazing. <laughs> and, she, and she's always singing with him on stage. Yeah. You, you always see them together. That's yes. amazing. Uh, so you spent some time in Franklin. You also spent some time actually in Nashville. What did yes. you do in Nashville? I know yep. you went to the Ryman. Exactly. Yeah. So the concert that we picked was Mitchell Tenpenny. He's a country guy that we had never seen before. And he was playing at the Ryman. And the Ryman is just, of course, a historic venue you have to go to in Nashville. And it's in a church. So to go is actually a really like amazing experience, kind of unlike any other concert venue you'd go mm -hmm. to. And so we absolutely loved that. And then we had to do the Bluebird Cafe. Okay. So the Bluebird Cafe is like this famed tiny little venue and like Taylor Swift used to play there. And now what's really special is they have songwriters come in and test out their songs. Yeah. So you might hear something that six months later you have, you know, Keith Urban playing on the radio. So it's a really like behind the scenes look at how like the recording industry works in Nashville. Yeah. And I guess to wrap us up, I was telling you before the interview that the last time that I've been there was I was a kid and I was really into Elvis at the time. I still am, but I was oh, yeah. really into Elvis at the time. Uh, lots of Elvis stuff to do there. There's the RCA Studio B where where he recorded a little bit. Talk yes, about that. that was so cool. So we did the Country Music Hall of Fame and as part of that you can book a tour to go to the to Studio B and so that's where so many famous artists recorded, including Elvis. So we actually stood in the room where he recorded. We saw his piano. They actually turn off the lights and like play his music so you can imagine cool. him like recording it there. It was so spectacular. You have to go. That's cool. And you got to go to Memphis. Uh, I was telling yes. you about that too. Memphis is cool. It's got Graceland and it's got the Sun Studios where Elvis recorded as well. Uh, it's an amazing place. Tennessee, man, it's, it's great. It's well, at. thank you so much. AustinTravels.com and that write-up is happening this month? Or? Yep, uh -huh. it'll be out this week. Awesome. Sounds good. Kristen Finan with Austin Travels.